We, well, we're, we're rolling, we're rolling. Okay. Can you <laughs> hey. guess the name from the, of this spell based on just this image? Well, first, look, I got wings, people! I'm a magical bee man! Okay, what do you got? <laughs> okay. Um. Well, it's yellow, so. Demon's piss? Golden shower! I was close! <laughs> you have to admit! I was close! <laughs> By the way, your spiders have spon are spontaneously having wings. That is the most terrifying shit ever. And Crystal Storm. I am seriously loving this knife. Yeah. Basically, to get, uh, to get it, uh, well, the way I got it was, um, you, I made, uh, a hollowed key, which you make with a bunch of, uh, souls of, um, light, and then you put a hollowed key in a chest in the hollow, uh, in the underground hollow, and it will turn that chest into a hollowed mimic. Cool. And then the hollow mimics can drop cool shit. Yeah. Ooh, let's do that. <laughs> well, after uh, we do okay. what we're gonna do. Um. Right. So. Oh yeah, your pixie. Uh, your fairy, I should say. Yeah, um, I want to get a fairy. Anyway, I got a bell. I got some pixie dust in here. So we need to get some. Well, souls of light, which are in the underground. Uh, hollow. And, uh, hey. I can't remember if I need crystal or not. It's like an awesome yo-yo. <laughs> Seriously, this is... So, the good thing with Golden Shower <laughs> is any enemies hit by it have their defense reduced. So, you basically, you took... It's basically, you, you know what, let's just call it what it is. It's a Jurati spell. Yeah. <laughs> In fact, it does turn anything hit by it yellow. So yeah, it, this is clearly a reference to the Jarati. Uh, Seriously, I love these bee wings. Yeah, uh, so I'll be getting. Uh, I should probably make a uh, mage armor instead of sticking to the spider armor, but. Hey, yeah. fucking spiders! You yeah. spider bitch, spider bitch, does whatever a spider bitch does. Call me bitch one more time! <laughs> Call me bitch one more time and you're gonna wake up cocooned in a web! Uh, I was just gonna say I'll use golden shower on you, but then again, some people. Well! <laughs> okay, I'm not saying that it is my fetish! <laughs> At least if it's on me! <laughs> <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. Or am I? Uh, is this yeah, lag, I... or are you just standing there? Okay, yeah, yep, just the lag. So, hmm. Can't remember, where is the hollow? Oh yeah, the hollow should... is beyond. Okay, now I remember. Uh, yeah. I really should show you my, um, my other world. We'll do that later. Yeah. With my sky rail. Yeah, so we get an idea of what to, what I have to do to help you make it, kind of thing. Uh, Sky Rail is the easiest thing to make, because basically you can auto, uh, all you have to do is, uh, you just have to get to the right spot first, and then, uh, put a few tracks down, and then from there, you can just move the minecart forward until it starts moving forward on its own, and then you just hold the button down and it'll just automatically place down tiles, well, tracks. Oh, so it's kind of like, it's a horizontal rope. Yeah, basically. That's cool. So you can just basically, like, uh, it took me uh, a couple of stacks, but again, it's like, one iron bar can pretty much make, uh, like... You can make a crap ton, either way. Yeah. Oh man, this is awesome. No fall damage! That's basically the exact same thing I did for my, uh, my hell rail. Okay, that works. Ah. Ah. 
Ah! Stupid okay? eyes. Yeah, I keep buddy. Yeah, it's the freaking eyes. Even when you know it's not gonna hold you. The uh, Crystal Storm is basically the magic version of the Mega Shark. That is so awesome. So how do you keep getting these spells? Um, well, you craft them using uh, hollowed stuff, like um. Ah. Well, at least Crystal Storm. Uh. That's you need to find crystals in the underground hollowed. So yeah, maybe we could uh, make me one if we have enough later. Because, I mean, I'm going to uh, need to replace them for my B gun. Yeah, but not... Sp I, I've been telling you, not spells. You... Like, the fact that you you want to go for melee means spells are going to be useless to you. Alright, fair enough. You, so, they'll, they'll chew through your mana and you get no use out of them. Okay, uh, well, I just kind of like having the backup. Yeah, well, that's, we'll get you the Mega Shark. And, and you know uh, what, I suppose this knife... This Flying knife is a good backup because it counts as range and no, it counts as melee. No, I mean as in it's ah, a range yeah, melee. Yeah, yeah. That's what I should have said. Yes. Okay. Silver coins, healing, lesser healing potion, bombs, and flurry boots. Mm -hmm. Again, we're beyond that kind of treasure. <laughs> I know, but it's so cool. Um. Uh, trying to think, uh, there is, uh, okay, here we go, here are the crystals. Okay, I was about uh, to ask, what are, what do they look like, but, <laughs> I think the game read my thoughts. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, one of the things, you can basically, uh, with the Mega Shark, uh, you can get crystal bullets. And which will basically turn the Mega Shark into the exact same thing as uh, Crystal Storm. Because Crystal Bullets uh, just ricochet all over the place. That is awesome. Well, and I, I think... believe it's like one Crystal wow, that, Shark. That one... looks like it's on drugs. At least at yeah. a rave. Illuminate, illuminate enemies are uh, what you find in the Underground Hollow. And it also has some of the best, one of my favorite music tracks. Okay, yeah, I found... Okay, so grab this one. Two. But now that we're here, uh, any enemy in the underground hollow, uh, no matter what kind of enemy it is, uh, it has a chance to drop a soul of light. Okay, so just kill, 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 and then we'll get what we need. Yeah. That's fair, that's fair. And dig up as many crystal shards as we need. Yeah. Basically, uh, in terms of crystal bullets, uh, one shard makes a hundred, if I recall. So, yeah, having a nice supply will be... It'll save us some green. Yeah. And, uh, you know, if I don't want to waste the bullets, I have the unlimited musket shot. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not the best, but hey... Oh, uh, I actually, I got a really cool, uh, when I was, when I was farming some hollow chests in my other world, I got a really cool bow for Andrew. Oh, nice. It's called the, the, De uh, Daedalus or Daedalus, uh, Stormbow. Cool. And what makes it special is it doesn't actually fire arrows from the bow. Uh, when you aim at an enemy and you shoot, the, uh, arrows come from the sky. Wow. So basically, arrow rain. Oh, you're in a spider area. Yeah. You are now the true queen of the spiders. Well, this is this is how I found my... To make the spider armor and the spider staff, you need spider fangs. Alright, well, I found some more crystals, so I'm going this way. Mm -hmm. I'll try and catch up with you. No worries. Spreading out is good. 
So Jeez. anyway, have you uh, tried watching the new Yu-Gi-Oh! Arc 5 at least? Uh, no, I haven't got around to it. Um, I've been meaning to because I I kind of saw a scene that uh, put a bit of a childish grin on my face. Hey, what would that be? I think it was... I believe I saw a scene of him like flying on a pig or something like that, a flying pig. Oh no! Oh, that performer pal P hippo. Ah, hippo. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <was> like... <laughs> See, in Art Five, they the technology, you know, the virtual technology has been improved so much. Their solid vision kind of things. Right. So now you, they can interact, Ooh. and that's <laughs> what started the performance tool. Ah, interesting. Hey, um, do you need a rod of Discord? Ooh, I can't remember what that is. Um, let's see. Uh, ready to go. Gotta find it. Okay, I got. Hey, I got a solar light. That's cool. Oh, rod of Discord. Teleports you to the position of the mouse. Ooh! Yes, please! Oh my god! This is gonna make mining so much more fun! You know what? I'll, I'll, go, I'll go to you. Oh crap, I accidentally <laughs> hit my mirror. <laughs> Sorry! Sorry! <laughs> uh, oh my god, I'm I am a goddamn idiot. From, you got that from a chaos armor? I think that's what they're called. Uh, chaos armor. Uh, it was elemental. like a little teleporting possessed armor thing. Yeah, Chaos Elemental. Yeah, that's it, yeah. Oh, this doesn't even use mana! Oh, really? Huh. Ow! Okay! Did it materialize? Yeah, I tried warping across the, uh, landscape, and, well... Here's some advice. Don't do it in a forest, because if you do it in a tree... Okay, I think I see what's going on. If I yeah, teleport you, can't, you can't do it into solid ground. No, I was doing it on. I think if I do it a little... Okay, if you do it too quickly, it'll fuck... It's gonna pay back. Ah. Uh. Okay, I see. Chaos state. Whenever you use the rod... It takes life. So since I was doing it rapidly, I basically uh, burned myself out. Fair enough. Okay, that's a fair... You know what? That's a fair enough trade. You know, I don't even remember... I wonder if that's either a new thing or if it's just... Uh, even when last time I... Like the, uh, when this was first added, uh, Underground Corruption, I mean, Hollow. I wonder if it's just so rare that I never even got it. Well, it's still, it's a little more interesting, yeah. right? Yeah. And hey, the viewers gotta watch me die horribly. <laughs> Although I would have also at you know what? I'm gonna try. Okay, I tried teleporting into solid rock to see if that actually would kill me. It doesn't even let you. Okay. So okay, there's something you're not gonna need to worry about. So basically, you can't use it to break uh or secrets break. Well, no. I mean, like, would it kill you? Like. Would yeah, it oh, teleport well, you into the rock and go. then kill you? Enchanted sword. Ah, uh, I didn't drop anything. Yeah, kind of like Ultima or something. Yeah. Or wizardry, that's it. Yeah, yeah wizardry. Nah, but uh, basically, um, what I was thinking of, uh, there's a... I'm actually surprised we never found it, but there's a special place that you can only get access to after defeating a certain boss in hard mode. Okay. And, uh... Oh my god, it's so, a unicorn! I'm gonna kill you! Oh yeah, I've completely re replaced my B mount. Yeah, I got a unicorn horn. Yeah, they're a crafting machine. I think you might need one of them for, um, the fairy. I'm not sure. Well, I got a unicorn horn, so... Yeah. Okay, I got a few souls of, uh... Well, I know what I'm going to title this episode. Hollowed Hunting. 
Oh yeah, I was going the wrong way. Anyway, so just click, boom. Nice. Okay. Uh, we'll have to get another one. Here you go. <laughs> I had my fun with it. You know how to take it. You have better responsibility with it. <laughs> I, you know, that's another reason why I shouldn't have the magic items because, well. I'm playing around with this flying dagger. I am not showing it the respect it deserves. <laughs> I do need to get a new uh, summon, though. A, a new minion pet. Um, I mean, the bee is good, and I will be keeping my, you know, bee outfit, because I think at this point, this should be my avatar yeah. for Terraria. I just, uh, here. I'll drop this down here. I got another oh, horn. Nice. I dropped the wrong thing. There we go. Oop. Yay! Imps. I shall name you... Cuddlefire. What the hell is that? <laughs> Uh, my, my flame barrier. N not so, doesn't seem so tough. Yeah, you're not an enemy. Oh yeah, good point. That's some smart magic, if it can tell. Heh. <laughs> yeah, I, I love it. It's become, it's become one of my, uh, must-haves for when I'm, you know, You know, I also, you know what I also like about this dagger that makes it useful? It can light up, yeah. Exactly. I like shit that it has a second utility to it. Yeah. Whoa. Uh, it's a, yeah, it's a, it's a flying snail. That's yeah, I like... thought for a moment, it's like, wait, is, are we underwater? Is this jellyfish? Is that a flying fish? <laughs> I know, isn't that awesome? <laughs> Uh, I mean, yeah, it sucks that it takes some life away, but... Give me good in a pinch. Okay, there's another two souls of light. Wait, how much does it take exactly? Huh. Get him! Ah, oh, no, it doesn't actually take life. What? It doesn't. It doesn't take life. So. Yeah, but what it, it puts is, you into. It puts you into no, a chaos it, state. Yeah, yeah. It puts you in chaos state, and then when you use it in chaos state, that's when it kills you. Uh, it doesn't actually use like your HP to use it. Ah. Yeah. I, okay. Ah, yeah, that's an easy way. God, I love it. Man, we're getting a lot of pink blocks. Yeah. Well, pink ice. It does look cool. Yeah. So, I've also figured out the order in which to fight the bosses. Okay, are we gonna fight the twins again? Nope, they're last. Really? They are actually, they are the hardest. Really? Yep. Huh. I even, like, when I was uh, doing the boss rush on my other character, I had trouble with the twins. Okay, I understand. Okay, I am currently at 14 crystals. Yeah, uh... Okay, I am at, uh, okay, I've got three souls of light and 15 crystals. Oh. Uh, I have two souls. I will just double check to see the actual, uh, required number. Yeah, and if there's we any- We might actually have enough. And any other material we may need. Because me, I just usually have all the stuff on me anyway, because I just, after every, like, uh, expedition into a biome, I just come back and just- can I craft anything? <laughs> Fair enough. 
Me, I'm more of the, I like to know what material I need to get and then go hunt for it. Yeah. Both our methods aren't wrong, it's just preference. Okay. 25 pixie dust. Ah! We need to beat the twins. What? You need 10 souls of sight. And I guess the best way to get sight the only way two giant sight. eyes. Yeah, the only way to get sight. Okay. God damn it. Uh, don't worry. Uh, I can wait, I can wait. Yeah. What, wait, the... what's your gear again? You're in tit uh, titanium, aren't you? Yeah. Well, except for okay. my mining helmet, but I, I put that on for the bosses. Yeah. And yes, it's so, in my inventory. Like it's in my hot bar now. Don't accidentally put it away. Oh, hey, we need more dust. I know a bitch you can use this. Because my name is <laughs> Seriously, somebody give us fan art of like Tinkerbell being a dealer. Cause that shit can't be free. <laughs> uh, well, I mean, at being someone who is a big Disney fan and will readily admit to having seen almost all of the Tinkerbell movies, really, I can tell you, yeah, uh, I can tell you for a fact that Fairy Dust is created by a giant magical tree, and it is rationed out to all the fairies. Okay, so yeah, she could, she's totally a dealer. <laughs> and there's a uh, Jack Skellington here who sells yo-yo stuff. Wait, repeat that? Ooh, uh, Jack Skellington. Really? Hmm. He's, a, he's an undead merchant. Cool. And, wow, this I never knew. He sells uh, special glow sticks, Spelunker glow sticks. Wait, what are they, you... Up here where I am. Oh, I'm going to join Pink Team. Oh, I thought you were talking about within the, uh... When you said Jack Skellington, I thought you were referring to... In the Tinkerbell movie. Nah, nah, nah. Oh, hello. Yeah. So yeah, he has, uh, special glow sticks. And exposes nearby treasure and wow! That's pretty cool. I mean, it doesn't exactly show you what it is. It just sparkles, but yeah. That, that's pretty cool. Yeah. And the thing is, uh, you, know, you, need, you can basically, just with one, you can um, hold it out to also see. Mm, I, hey, that's at least something useful. Yeah. I think pixies have a better chance of actually spawning on the surface. Really, somewhere. But I'm not looking for pixies. I'm just hunting for more crystal. Well, we've got like uh, 30 between us. Alright, I have... 24. Okay, and I've got like uh, 17 I think I've got. 16. Whoa, 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 whoa. Fire elemental. Yeah, mining. Wow. There's a lot of crystals here. Yeah. And there's an enchanted sword. A what? Enchanted sword. Whoa! <laughs> oh. Dive easy. Yeah, this surprised me. This took you guys surprise. Yeah. That's all light. We need those as well. Mm -hmm. I like the hollow. I mean, yeah, it's supposed to essentially be a nicer version of corruption, but that's the thing. It's a nicer version of corruption. Hey, I got a mechanical <laughs> worm. 
Yeah. It summons a destroyer. No, no, not using it. Yeah, so that is actually the easy use of the mechanical trio. <laughs> and I found it! Yeah, even though I've already got one on me, just in case we need to find one or make one. <laughs> well, how appropriate, isn't it? <laughs> Can you guess what, what it is? Well, given that it's called a mechanical worm and it's called the destroyer, I'm guessing it's the Terminator version of the Eater of Worlds. Yep. Got it all in one? I believe I actually, I hinted at it in an earlier session. Really? Yes. We were talking about, oh, how do you make the Eater of Worlds harder? Oh. And oh. I said, can you remember what I said? <laughs> what did you say? To remind the viewers? Uh, make it shoot spikes everywhere. That would be a problem. Yeah, just now, if you replace spikes with a mechanical version, uh, you get lasers. Man, I dig so fast, it's nuts. Yeah. I love it. I love that sound. <laughs> it, it's kind of cathartic. <laughs> yeah, it's a, it's like one of the most, it's like the trope's most wonderful sound. Yeah, because it's, it's, it's a nice hollow sound, so it's, you know, it's not harsh to the ears. Yeah, it just sounds, and it makes you feel like you're really making progress. Yeah, because it's just... Due to being so fast. But, oh crap, I'm drowning. Uh, I'm surprised my, my flame wings can work underwater. <laughs> yeah, you would think that would be a design flaw. But then again, it's magical fire. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Huh. I found lime kelp. Huh. Oh, oh man, I, I just forgot. Uh, I there was actually another present I was gonna give you that I found. Uh, I got from my extractinator. Your what? Extractinator. What's an extractinator? Um, it basically turns, uh, you know, the sort of slush, sand, silt, those kind of uh, blocks into something useful. So like you can get ore and whatnot from it. Oh. And there is a rare chance for a drop. It's not, it's not anything useful, but I actually got one, and I'm like, Bren would absolutely love this. Well, okay, you know what, let's warp back home and then you can give it to me, because I want to meet the merchant. Okay. Okay, now where is this merchant? I'll be hey, back. merchant! Get your ass! Oh, you're going back to your world? Yeah, yeah, i got to get it from uh, okay. my other chest. I'll go find the goddamn merchant. And that's when we'll end the episode in, wow, 30 minutes. I really gotta pay more attention. Okay, he has a gypsy robe. And a magic hat. And a katana. And a companion cube. Five platinum for a freaking companion cube. Will I at least do my taxes if it's going if you're gonna make me spend that much? You dick. <sighs> I swear he is trying to jip me, isn't he? Yeah, he is. He is a traveling merchant. I mean not that I don't blame him for doing it, but it doesn't mean I have to like it. It's like the government. I know the governments are a bunch of assholes, but I know they're also the only thing that's keeping us from anarchy. But doesn't mean I'm gonna like them. Yeah. Although in some cases, I think anarchy might be preferable. Please just stop. And another thing. Yeah, okay, I'm done. Hmm. 
So, question with the destroyer. Yeah? Where do we have to summon him? Ah, oh, it doesn't matter where. Okay, okay. Yeah, we got so many crystals. We're now singing. <laughs> Actually, when it comes to the way my wings and, you know, when I jump, I basically get my wings. It's like my cloak is my wings. <laughs> <It's> like, <laughs> cloak, wings. Cloak, wings. Cloak, wings. <laughs> okay, so where are you? I'll meet you. Oh, there you are. Alright, what do you, what do you, you got? What do you got? It's not even my birthday. What have you got? An amber mosquito. Hmm? No. No. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh god, that is that is quite possibly the most adorable. <laughs> oh, I mm. wish there was a way you could have like your pet so you could like set them up so that they you could just can just roam around. You ah, uh, you can have it so you don't have to keep summoning it, but you already know that. I know, but what I want to know is, I mean, like, put a part of, like, your village. Like, you can have a little bee and your penguin and then your little dinosaur. <laughs> oh, it's so cute. I'm gonna name you Chompy. I call him Chomper, but I think people would rather they're not believe that the uh, Land Before Time sequels happened. <laughs> it is cool how when you activate it, I, when you like hold it, I see it. Oh, yeah, I just noticed that. Yeah, I see all the effects. Okay, so end of this episode. Next one. Dun 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 dun. Okay, till next time. <laughs>